Hey you guys, what's up? It's Danielle with The Victorious Carnivore and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I just want to share a quick update, kind of an announcement with you and something kind of fun that we are going to be doing in March. <laughs> March, my husband and I have decided to do the lion diet. So we are going to do a 31 day lion diet challenge and we want to invite you all to participate. So this is not going to be anything like really formal. I'm not going to really set up any official group or anything, not this time around anyway, maybe in the future for other challenges, but we still wanted to throw it out there for you guys. I know in the comments of other videos that I've shared, a lot of you are sharing that you are either trying carnivore or wanting to. Some of you have even mentioned the lion diet and some of you might already be doing that or are wanting to try that as well. And so we just figured let's let all of you guys know and you are more than welcome to join us in the month of March. So what we will be doing for the lion diet is we will be the eating only ruminant meats. Uh, for my husband and I, we are planning to eat beef, bison, elk, and probably some lamb. Those are the ruminant meats that we're planning on so far. If I come across any others, we may throw some in there um, as well. But we're sticking to the ruminant meat. We're only having salt as seasoning, so no other seasonings or sauces, just salt and the ruminant meat. And then as far as what we're going to drink, that's where we're gonna differ just a little bit. I am probably just gonna do water. I may do a little coffee here and there. I haven't quite decided on that one yet. Um, and then my husband, he will continue to drink coffee and he will also drink kombucha. He has experienced some great things with his digestion and weight loss drinking kombucha, so he does not wanna cut that out. So we are mostly doing the lion diet, but we have a, you know just a couple of variations there that I wanted to share with you. But uh, for the challenge, if you guys decide you want to do this, I am going to be posting daily update videos for all of the month of March. So <laughs> this will kind of be like a secondary challenge for me because I have never put out a video every day on YouTube for any stretch of time. I mean, there may have been like a three day stretch of time where I happened to have a video come out each day, but I have never intentionally done videos like that where I'm filming one day and I'm turning around and posting the video the next day. So that is gonna be another challenge in and of itself for me in the month of March, but I really want to do this and I really want to share with you. So if you follow along, I'll have a video post every day that will be kind of like a daily check in of how the lion diet is going for my husband and I. I'll add in tips and different things along the way, things I'm learning, things I feel like might help you. And I also plan to have part of that video be a daily encouragement for all of us. So I actually encourage you to follow along even if you don't take us up on the diet, uh, the lion diet challenge, just follow along um, for that daily encouragement because no matter where you're at in your journey, we all could use some encouragement, especially on a daily basis. <laughs> so that's kind of my plan to just throw something in there that could encourage all of us. And then too, if you're not ready for the lion diet, maybe you just want to try carnivore, maybe you just want to make a simple tweak to what you're already doing. I encourage you to follow along as well and just take that encouragement and apply it to whatever you're doing. So that's just kind of what I wanted to share with you guys. Uh, one, to let you know the next iteration of Joshua and I's journey. I'm gonna be sharing a couple other videos here soon before March. I'm just updating you all on where I'm at. Um, and then, like I said, in March, I'm gonna do a daily update video, check-in video, um, and just encourage all of us, no matter where we're at in our journeys. Um, I do wanna give you a heads up that the videos coming in March are gonna be very just off the cuff, like kind of like this one. Like I'm just, I sat down in my kitchen over lunch break and I'm filming a video for you guys. Um, that's kind of what March is gonna be like because doing uh, daily videos, I don't know how much time I will have to edit and add in music and make them look all pretty. Um, if I have time, I'll do it. But if I don't, it's just gonna be very raw, 
footage just to give you guys updates and take you along on this journey and to hopefully encourage any of you if you want to join in. All right, you guys, comment below if you will be joining us in this challenge or comment below if you're going to challenge yourself to do something else or either cut something out or add something in for 31 days in the month of March. I feel like this is a great time to do this because sometimes we can get discouraged as we get past January and into February and maybe those New Year's resolutions or those new goals we had, we might feel like we've already messed up or we're already wanting to give up. But I just encourage all of us that let's not let the new year be the only time that we can make a change for the better. Let's stick with it. Let's reset, restart. March is a great time to just do that. So wherever you're at, just I encourage you to consider what can you do in the month of March uh, 31 days, maybe you'll form a new healthy habit, but what can you do that might take you a step further in your journey? And I'd love to hear that below um, in the comment section and stay tuned for more videos and get ready for March. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> we'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.